This is a glimpse inside the future of heavy-duty trucks. It's a much quieter and much more Earth-friendly one. This is one of Daimler Truck North America's electric heavy-duty trucks. The company already has a test fleet of the e-trucks out on the roads and will start manufacturing the real thing late next year. Electrification is something that's been talked about for a number of years, but now it's really starting to accelerate. In fact, the company says within the next two decades, those diesel-powered semi-trucks you see rumbling down the highways will be no more. We would guess that by 2039, we're not making diesel trucks anymore. Uh, and, and certainly, uh, it could happen even faster than that. The change is afoot, and it seems to be even accelerating faster than we initially thought it would. To help the heavy-duty truck manufacturer develop its zero-emission fleet, it partnered with Portland General Electric to install this first-of-its-kind heavy-duty electric truck charging station. It's called Electric Island. We know that transportation is the largest source of carbon emissions in our economy. And so through collaboration, we can really make a difference. The new station is located on Swan Island, right across from Daimler's headquarters and less than a mile from I-5. Its eight charging stations can charge electric vehicles of all shapes and sizes, from cars to buses, box vans, and of course, semi-trucks. But it will also allow the companies to further study chargers like this and their performance. Knowledge that will be put to good use as more drivers go electric and more EV models become available. There's 50 different models you can choose from in Oregon today, everything from small cars um, to SUVs, and soon we're going to start to have pickup trucks, which will be really exciting. And before we know it, all trucks will be merging into the EV fast lane, even the biggest ones. It is the future, absolutely. Keely Chalmers, KGW News.